Okay, hello and welcome to the channel. This is just a quick tutorial about how to get GIFs into ArtStation, um, obviously for free. Um, you could download software like uh, Adobe, uh, the Adobe Encoder or um, any of the software for Adobe, um, but I don't currently have any of that installed, so the way that I create my GIFs, like these ones below here, um, and they need to be below 10 megabytes, um, the way I create them, um, things like moving lights, uh, is with shortcut. So I could have cut off the corners on this, made the aspect ratio different in my render, and I would have saved, I could have made that file bigger. Uh, but generally, yeah, I've got GIFs in this one as well, this one we're looking at. Obviously, you've got to make it quite a bit smaller than your images. Um, but I think they get some good results, and I've started putting them in all of my uploads so pretty much yeah pretty much every upload that I make I think other than like some of these ones yeah I don't I haven't put gifts in these um, but it doesn't take too long to render out some stuff and then you're going to have to I'll start fresh on this you're gonna to have to do some like trial and error um, because this software is just like any other software um, and you'll drag your video in and then past that point um, you click on file export video and then this side window will come up um, hit gif if you want a gif um, if you don't want a gif then your baseline profile there is probably a good one or your high profile or main pro yeah any of the H264s are good um, but for a gif um, you're going to want to click on that and then you've got your different stuff here so you've got your quality which can help quite a bit but I don't really like lowering that too much uh, because that's one of the most noticeable things about bad GIF I think um, I'd rather have a smaller image um, which these are not locked so what I've been using is just this aspect ratio calculator and I started off with like 800 and then that was too small so I went up to 1000 and that was too big so I went to 900 and I was fine with that um, and then if once you've got sort of a good size that you want so for me it's 900 by like 500 or 506 once you've got a good size that you want um, then you're going to want to change the frame rate obviously like that I had 10 frames and if I export that at the moment with 10 frames like so this is what I originally did I, I'll export with 10 frames and I can show in folder um, and this is just using what's in the screen at the moment uh, you don't need to use the timeline below then you'll see that it's just above what it needs to be so it needs to be just a little bit lower so I've got a few options I could take a few points off both of these um, I could put that to 50% uh, but I didn't I decided to take it to nine frames a second um, and then when I export which I just exported to a different one but uh, there we go you can see that that is now that extra frame has taken just um, the amount that I need off it as close to 10 megabytes as I can get it um, and then that's obviously acceptable to upload to your art station. Um, and that's pretty much it. If you did want to do some video editing real quick in this software, then you drag the videos in um, and you can get them over here. So your, um, your videos will come in there and then you're going to want to drag that down into your uh, into your timeline and then you can add multiple videos that way I don't have multiple example videos uh, but this isn't shortcut tutorial uh, that should help you get your video your gifs into ArtStation um, I hope that helped and I'll see you next one